This video is just a short extract from the entire course. If you wish to see all of the videos from this series at higher quality and in far larger screen size, head over to ifskills.com. In another exercise, we went through and created the systems for hydronic supply, return, and sanitary for the fan core units in this view. Now I want to create a piping system for each of those mechanical piping systems. If I use the tab key to select the objects in that system, I can then use the layout tool to generate a layout. Notice how I've got two layout types that I can generate standard pipes and placeholder pipes. Here I'm going to go with the standard pipes. We can then have a look at the solutions. I'm going to ignore sloping for the time being and I can then look through the different options of layouts. Notice in here that we have a blue line that signifies the main run of pipe and a green line that signifies a branch pipe. Let's check out the other options. I can also check on the settings to make sure that my main run is running at the right level and my branch run is also running at the correct level for my design. Once I'm happy with the layout, click on Finish Layout. Here I've been presented with a warning. This warning says that the application is unable to make a connection in the direction. What I've neglected to do in this exercise is check that I have enough room for my connections. So what we can do at this point is undo, look at the solutions again, choose the one that is most suitable, and maybe have a look at these settings again. And this time I'll change the RL for the layout. Let's try that one more time and see what the result is when I click on Finish Layout. We receive no error messages with that, and in plan, Everything looks fine, apart from my visual clash with a column.